Nice, let's go. What's going on, everyone? And welcome back to more Black Desert. So, today was patch day. There wasn't any updates. There were a few new events. Um, they extended the boss thingy where you get, like, double loot and all that stuff. And maybe we'll actually have a blood spawn nuver for, like... There were only, what, maybe three blood spawn nuvers in, like, 20 of them throughout the past like two weeks of the event and that was just like the one thing i was actually needing and every time new spawned i was actually kind of excited because i just don't want that and um i think we're actually getting pretty close so to show you where we're at um in terms of our nuver progress we got one down already and so we got the we need to get the helmet to uh max as well so it's like 21,000 Blackstones. Um, that's not the hard part at all. It's getting the Bloodlet Eyes, and we're at 140. You need 210 to get it from, like, basically zero to pen, in a way. And so, uh, yeah, we're at that. And hopefully another Blood Spawn Nuver just spawns one week. We have just one of them, please. And then I'll be done. And then, yeah. So, what we're going to be doing today is some casual stuff. A lot of you guys said you enjoy watching me just do, like, what I would do not recording. So every now and then, I think maybe, like, once a week we'll do that. Um, so we're going to have to do Rift Bosses today. Maybe we'll get something good. Today we have one in the desert. So, yeah, unfortunate. I know. But there was another thing that I think started today. I don't actually know where the NPC is. It's probably... I have to read the patch notes again. But, um... It's like you get a new, what is it? The thing where you, it's over here, like the tomb thingy. And uh, it's like loot or item drop rate. 10% is for like, what, two weeks. So it's definitely worth doing. And so there's two options. One is like monster damage. And the other one is uh, damage reduction. So yeah, depends where you grind. I would recommend just getting them both, and I think that's pretty cool. So, pretty awesome. Hopefully, like, I can't believe that uh, in two games I played, there were no patches, but I guess it makes sense because it's the Lunar New Year thing, so everyone's busy. No updates. Makes sense. But that's fine. And in another news, in terms of, like, other games, I don't know how many people actually care. Um, they did a reveal for Bethesda and for everyone who's followed the Elder Scrolls Online on the channel. They announced some new stuff coming, like, next expansion, which is awesome. So, the one Puternum, I believe, is out in the middle of the desert. They actually changed the spawn location. It, was, it used to be at, like, Fogans, right? Fogans and Crescents. Now they just have it in the middle of the desert above the hill. Which is good, because I actually memorized... Well, not really memorized, but, like, it's easier to get to. So, that's a thing. So what I do is just go down here. And it's like past two hills or something. Should be like down here somewhere. I'd like to think the boss would just pop at some point. I may have overshot it, to be honest. It's somewhere in the area. I 
I just wonder if it was actually just like right here. Okay, there it is. About to get closer to it. One thing I wanted to do more is uh, play a little bit of Awakening again. I just had the urge to do that. But I do, I really do enjoy Succession. I just want to play uh, Awakening again. I wish the Shadow Bullet just wasn't a useless skill. Why does Dark Knight have, like, so many useless skills, but then they give, like, an amazing kit to all the other classes? Let's go. Nice. All right, so four more rift bosses. What are we doing? Um, Red Nose, Muskin, Sonal, and Ronin. Where are those? So we're probably just gonna have to take this uh well. Where are we going? Um Okay, so all of them are over here, but then there's one all the way in Grana. Might as well just do that one first. And then end up with the three in the middle. But yeah, maybe we'll do the new quest to for the event. Hold on, let me, while we look at it, let me pull up the patch notes to figure out what I'm actually doing. Alliston in Velia. Got it. Okay, we'll do that at the end. I think there's one where it's like kill a thousand enemies, which is uh, something I'll be doing uh, like later. Okay, we have silver on us. Nice. 76 million silver today. Oh my god. I forgot to transport my horse back. That's fine. I'll transport my main horse to Velia because we'll be there in like 10 minutes. I wish you didn't have to go through like four cut scenes and like all these extra. T 
10 mil just to get from Altanova to Grana. As, like, I know that sounds like a lot, but it's actually kind of worth it. <laughs> Is it is Madaya? Stone tip. No, that's not it. It is sand grain. Okay. Still like 10 minutes, right? I believe. You got like mid tier unicorn today, that's fine. Can't fly, feels bad. Stones. I'm gonna need it. We actually have um, enough, pro or not enough, but like we're getting close to another click for our Tet Fallen God armor. All right. We're almost. Almost done. I'm gonna go. Hold on, let me see. Is it better to go to Serendio? Yeah, let's go to Serendian, not uh, Balanos. We'll end up in Velia, then we'll transport. One day I'll get a tier 10 unicorn, one day. I would say though, my horse RNG is pretty solid, but then me enhancing any sort of gear is not. <laughs> so I guess that's what balanced out. my microphone and like you know how it looks slanted this way but it's slightly slanted it's like straight i don't know how to describe it we just paid like 17 million silver just to do speed running rift bosses how does this make you feel? <laughs> Honestly, the time saver is so good. I just wish they would come up with a system where it would be like, there's like a sign or something. Like other MMOs do this. So if you want to fast travel, there's like a sign outside and then you could uh, pick where you want to go and then 
Then you jump down to well and just take you there, so you skip like three cutscenes or something. I was actually just about to eat over the river, but then I realized we don't have our Pegasus. So we gotta run it the old fashioned way. God, that's what the unicorn has, a double jump. It's kind of helpful. Oh my god. That is a no-go. That is a broken bridge. I remember that. All of our taxpayer money in this game can't even fix the bridge. Do people still go to often? I should probably leave a boss alt there, to be honest. Muskin, my least favorite one. While oh, we're at it, let's actually see what's in the cash shop. What was on the sale today? That's such a weird outfit. Like, who designed that? Like, I don't think it's bad. It's just kind of weird. <laughs> Dark Knight one. Why does that just look like... Leather and plastic. I don't know. That one... I don't like that one. It's kind of weird. Is that it for sales today? Like... Lunar sale pack. Seven days. Discount coupon. Wait, when does this expire? One thirty. Nothing good this week. Feels bad. It's okay.
I'm convinced like rift bosses actually ignore resistances. stones actually how many do i have uh muskin's aura 97 plus one this is just boss day jump <laughs> never know are they attacking my horse they better not be One more. And they get 440. Nice. How many do you guys have, actually? nice if I could got okay if I can get a begs glove or one of those uh 500 mil light stones iridescent ones oh of course not <laughs> all right one more rift boss and then we'll do the Alliston thing and just see what I have to uh hand over You don't really realize how much you miss your Pegasus until you don't have it. Because what I would have done originally was go to that Sheep Mountain and just yeet myself all the way to Velia. I think I would have been there already, to be honest. this boss gets bugged and just doesn't spawn i don't know why but it's only this one transitions no one wants those you know one day one of my goals is to just have like a dp meme build literally Pen centaurs, pen 
Kadri rings. What is it? What do people use uh, for the necklace, actually? I, th I feel like I should know this. Uh... I still don't think you use Lunar, though, or the Revive River. You use the Lunar, but not the River. I'm pretty sure for, um, belt, or not belts, for necklaces, I think you, if you are a DP, you still use something else. I'm pretty sure. Like, even if you are a full meme, I think you, you might use, like, Sissel or something. This river just seems like it's useless. But I'm pretty sure, in terms of belts, what would I do for full DP? Uh, full centaur. Uh, earrings would be... I think either Narc or Ethereal. I think probably Narc if you want some damage with it and don't want it to be just straight tank, no damage. Uh, rings, obviously, would be Kadri's. All right, let's see. Did my horse arrive. Transport to sand grain. Friend, I missed you. All right, let's go talk to Alliston, and then we'll see what we have to do, and then probably wrap up the video. Am I missing something? Or is this after maintenance? I feel like this should be live right now. Should be an event quest. There is one thing I gotta check though. It might have reset. I don't know. This was, uh... So, okay, so they say one... One per week. And I don't know if that means after maintenance. Or, like, after reset after maintenance. Okay, let me just... I'll wait till later tonight to check that one, because I'm not 100%. Otherwise, I'll just dump them for whatever. And this one... Is there like a quest line I'm supposed to be doing? Hold up. Show Alliston. Wait, hold on. Let me check the event. Um.
how does one go about showing it? Like, I'm literally looking at the page. I'm pretty sure this is like after maintenance or something because it's not clicking. Maybe I'm just dumb, but I don't know. It's not happening. All right, well, that's it for today. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.